Hello, my name is Louie, and today I've got... Damon with Premier RV. I was just saying, we haven't done a video in a while, so... I hope you brought your A-game. Always, I'm ready. All right, Bring so it on. Today we're excited about a 2022 Newmar Country Star. Bath and a half, 40 footer. 40 foot, that's pretty nice floor plan. I love the colors. Yep. Yeah. Really a uh, great condition coach. Why buy new? Why buy new? You can buy this. Save some money, right? Mm -hmm. We're gonna be asking 229,000. This coach only has like 13,000 miles. Yep. Yep. So good opportunity for someone to make a great deal on a pre-owned coach. And it's a one owner that he kept here the whole time. So it's been garaged its whole life. Yeah. So. Again, we're always looking for a nice, clean inventory. We've had some nice coaches come in here recently. So uh, if you have a pre-owned diesel pusher that's in good condition, we'd love to have the opportunity to sell it, right? Yeah, we've had some great mixes of different types of inventory, and it's uh, going to be interesting on some of the videos that will be coming up here in the next couple weeks. Yeah. So we're going to get this outside, mm -hmm. and then we'll do the interior and wrap it up here in a little bit. All right, let's go. All right, thank you. Thanks. Pretty beautiful day today, uh, October, what? Eighth? Sixth or seventh or, yeah, somewhere yeah. in there. Yeah, yeah 80, I, 81 degrees. I, I love it. So yeah. we got the 2022 outside. It's a floor plan 4037, mm -hmm. bath and a half. Um, fuel tank size? 100 gallons, dual fills. Freightliner chassis, uh, has comfort drive, solid front axle. So uh, 51 degree wheel cut. Yeah. Um, I love the colors. I mean, it's full body paint. They yeah. call this color Roca. And yeah, when I first saw the colors on this, I was like, oh, that's a hit. This yeah. is beautiful. Beautiful oh. colors. Um, it's got Ooh. Michelin tires. They're original all the way around. And flush fitting slide rooms. 305s. 30570. Yeah. Power awning and door awning. Yeah, I like the flush mount windows. Mm -hmm. Dual the, pane. They're paint, uh, they do an excellent job with sanding in between mm -hmm. the lines there. Um, boy, yeah, well, really well done. Let's get into some of these bays. What do we got here? Bay number one, half bay. We got the Harbor Freight toolbox with uh, some accessories. They're getting out of RVing, so everything that you see goes with it. Got an extra entry step here. That's always nice to have. Yeah. Looks like some awning patio mats. Is that what you think that is, Lou? Yeah, I would. I'm sure they are. I told them to leave anything that they didn't want. Mm -hmm. Just leave it in the coach. The new owner might want it. So that famous little table that goes on the passenger seat for a computer is back there also, laying on the in the bay. So they have that. And like you were saying, they're from Oregon. I mean it. It is clean underneath. Oh, yeah. There's no rust or corrosion. Yeah. Uh, you got some kind of an outdoor Coleman smoker or grill. I, I'm not sure what that is. And some folding chairs, more accessories. Yeah, this aluminum area right here, that's just, that says it all because that's where all the crud sits and corrodes. Yeah, and the more, yeah, from the road. You can road. eat off these. Yeah. What do we got here? We got some hoses and some those are those leveling link blocks. You can put them under the jacks, give you a little more leverage. Central vac up here, and uh, extra ten foot sewer hose. Oh, you gotta have the rake. Uh, did you leave this in here by mistake, no, Louis? No, no. This is <laughs> that's great. 
<laughs> Tire covers, some wheel chocks. Fresh water is? 105. 105 mm -hmm. and gray? 65, 45 on black. It's nice sizes. I like how they always do the pegboard there. Mm -hmm. Give you about five or six inches and you can, oh, a little oh. slam door. There you go. We'll adjust that one for you. We forgot the TV though, Damon. Oh yeah. The plastic is still on it. Never used. Wow. Sound bar. Got a little Bose sound bar. Mm -hmm. That's nice. It's got two uh, propane furnaces. There's the exhaust for one in the kitchen. And it looks like the second one is in the bathroom, the half bath. Got the electric patio awning. Yeah. Looks like a carefree, huh? Nice porch light up there. A little storage here. Mm-hmm. This is a chassis service bay with your starting batteries and a disconnect. Got the washer dryer vent up here for that stacked washer dryer in the rear bath. Boy, it's pretty flawless. Mm-hmm. 360 horse Cummins. Louie's gonna show you the radiator. I have no idea why, but hey, there's the <laughs> rear mounted radiator. Looks like we got a seven way bargeman flat right here. It's prepped for an airline for your tow vehicle. 10,000 pound hitch, two inch receiver. So you're all set to tow. Actually, and they have a white 2017 Chevy Equinox if someone's interested in purchasing that with this coach. Package deal. And the tow bar and everything would yeah. be joined together. So That'll match the coach nice. Yeah, yeah. Boy, the back cap's nice. I love how they do the it's curve recessed. back here. Yeah. yeah, beautiful. Backup camera up there and engine air intake on the left up high. Yeah. Boy, it is like brand spanking new, huh? What do we got up here, Lou? We've got this continuous hot water system. Those are pretty cool. What do you think of that? I like it better than a 10-gallon heater. <laughs> yeah. A couple of our techs have those in their motorhomes, and, and they seem to like them too. Trumas. Yeah, they've been taking them out of the old hot water heaters, right? Mm -hmm. the water heaters, yeah. A little storage here. Some jack pads, sewer hose slinky. You gotta have that. Transfer switch, and your 50 amp cord. Yep. Def is on the driver's side, which is good. So what is this? that Newmar has for us. Sewer hose holder. Yeah. Kind of cool. I was going to tell you that, but yeah. Oh, no. Yeah. He's sorry to cut you off. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Boy, that is brand new. Yeah. I don't know if they ever really use this very much, obviously. No, it's super clean. So it's got a winterizing kit built in and outside shower. Low point drains, water pump, black and gray tanks, black and gray rinse, whole house filter. I just love it when people take care of their stuff. This yeah. is pretty incredible. Beautiful. You know, 13,000 miles, but they definitely kept on it. Yep. What, probably 2,500 miles from the factory to here? So Exactly. Some pretty good storage. Yeah, with a raised rail chassis, you still get quite a bit of storage mm -hmm. here. It's like these doors don't end. Look at that. Six golf cart batteries on a slide tray and a 32 gallon propane tank. Dual fill on the dual fill. fuel tank. Yeah. So propane, continuous hot water heater, the two furnaces, stovetop. That's it. That's it. That's it.
I mean, that'll last a long time. Yeah. Got your residential all, all those fridge. systems are very efficient, so. Mm -hmm. Slam doors, huh? I mean, even these rims, look at the polish on them. Yeah. So you're going to have a little access panel here to get the to the front generator. This is a 8,000 watt Onan quiet diesel generator with 24 hours. 24 hours? <laughs> yeah, you haven't had to service the thing yet. I think 100 what, hours. 50 hours is the first, right? Yeah, 50 is the first. <laughs> There's a, a quick connect for air right here. I think the word for today, Damon, is why buy new when you could buy. Yeah. I mean, that's. Pretty incredible. Yeah, depreciated and more importantly, debugged. Yeah. Yep. Man, it's got a good looking front cap. I like the headlights, fog lights down below, one piece windshield. Yeah, pretty nice coach. Let's go inside and take care of the rest. What okay, do you think? let's do it. Thank you. Damon, we got to the inside. This is pretty incredible. I love the contemporary look of this coach. Yeah, it's very open, light colors, airy. Mm -hmm. We've got the glazed maple, kind of a patina stain. Yeah, beautiful cabinets. I like the tile backsplash and countertops. MCD shades all the way around, Lou. Yeah, and I really like a 40-footer with a bath and a half, especially because you're not giving up certain parts of the floor plan as far as Look at the size of that sofa and got a nice size galley where the shorter ones, when they do bath and a half, you really give up a lot of this space. You do. Sometimes you get a residential fridge or a pantry. And we're going to show you that here in a second, but that's a great point. So you're going to get the residential refrigerator and the pantry, and the pantry. where some of them, it's kind of a smaller fridge. Yeah. And the shorter bath and halves, they, yeah. they got to make cut somewhere. So what do you think of the floor? It's a nice uh, wood plank floor. Plank looking LVT looks great. I yeah. mean, lightweight, durable. I think it works good in a motorhome. I like it better than carpet. Yeah, the finishes are very nice. They're kind of a light gray uh, leathers here, and then the backsplash. Um, again, mm -hmm. it's very contemporary. I like the stainless microwave there and the refrigerator. But uh, no, it looks really good. They did a really nice job with the colors. We got the TV lift also. Yeah, it's elevator and right behind a height of bed. Um, I mean, they packed a lot into this motorhome. It's a great value for. We've got four TVs, so if you're a football fan or news mm -hmm. fan, weatherman, yeah. you can have weather here, sports here. You got a lot or of Or sports here, sports here. Yeah, I mean, got enough TVs, right? There's a lot. And these do rotate around, so that gives you a lot more seating also, which yeah, is really cool. Yeah, swivel and recline. Um, do you want to talk about the cockpit there? Sure. I like that. It's all digital. Yeah, that's awesome. So Freightliner chassis, like we've been talking about. And uh, a little digital dash action, huh? Digital dash. So backup camera right there. Looks like a GPS system. Yep. Yeah, navigation. Oh. Oh. It's sensitive. We've got low air, that's all right. Low air, but uh, 13,627 miles. Nice digital display. We'll crank that, that off for our ears. Thank you, Damon. Smart wheel. You got a little storage down here. Got a little area to charge the phone right there, too, on top, huh? Charger right up here and some yeah. outlets. Uh, generator start stop switch, air horns, overhead fans. Shades and visors, MCD again up here. Boy, it's not missing an option, is it? No, auto leveling on the left, two cup holders, uh, battery boost switch, 
the mirrors are great they're huge remote mirrors with heat yeah it's got everything you'd need up front here yeah no with the two cup holders that's that's some thinking right there yeah i like that and you know it was uh two or three hundred and fifty thousand new now it's 229 i mean somebody's yeah. basically this is the best way to buy them they've debugged it they've taken the depreciation that's exactly what i was going to say and now yeah. it's ready to go yeah if something's already happened it's already happened it's already so, happened uh no that's a great thing so um again we go through every single coach we'll do a complete inspection mm -hmm. uh, once we get a deposit we run it through our system and we're very thorough at what we do so that's good yeah uh good seating here two nice lazy boy recliners with swivels I like all the light switches and stuff. The shades and everything are all right here. Multiplex lighting. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, the dining room table's got a little leaf that's in the back. So here we go right here. And then they've done a nice job with, with the drawer here. Another one here, and then you're going to have a file drawer, I would expect. So... Lots of storage, uh, very functional on this side. This is where people put their laptops and stuff, right? Yeah. Oh, maybe not on this one, but you could if you wanted it. You could put a printer here, so. A little easy to modify that, where you could just keep it in there all the time mm -hmm. rather than put it away and stuff, so that, I like that. What do you think about the kitchen? Nice space. Yeah, it's large. It's got the rollout with a couple more drawers, plus all the drawers under the cooktop. We're going to have a gas stovetop here, three burner. It's like new with an electric igniter. Lots of storage and nice depth back here. Yeah. And a double stainless sink. I like that. more storage over here to the left of the microwave adjustable shelf a little trash can area here a little pull down for your washing things and a little bit more storage I'll open these up too down here I like the hardware full extension it is and then this is how you close them, Louie, with your hands instead of your feet. So oh. That works out really good that way, thanks too. Thanks for pointing that out, Damon. Sure. Yeah. And these are probably pull-downs here and uh, change the filters. Yeah. And a diffuser. The roof yep. Make them quiet. So. Mm -hmm. How many roof fares on this, Coach? Two. Okay. 8K generator? 8K generator with uh, 140 hours. Very low hours. So being a bath and a half, here's your... Secondary water closet. And then Damon was talking about the residential refrigerator and look at that pantry, that's nice. Yeah. Boy, it smells brand new in here. It is. I mean, I mean it's, well, I don't think they use it very old. much. Back in the bedroom, we've got a, it looks like a king. King bed. That's nice. That's the other thing about the 40 footers with a king. Gives you some valuable space, a little bit of a nightstand on each mm -hmm. side. Got um, USB ports and outlets. Storage underneath. I'm sure that's where the leaf is for the table, folding chairs. Mm -hmm. Got a, a central vac port right down here in the middle of the motorhome. Feels like an air bed too, so that's nice. Double yeah. wardrobe, a lot of shirt closet on this here. Side too. Got the original Numar owner's manuals in the original container. And a whole bunch of drawers down here. We'll open these middle too the size of them yeah good storage mm -hmm. got a stack washer dryer back here nice vanity sink a little storage here and 
the shower is actually a pretty good size. Jack, I think you would fit in there, but we won't do it today. <laughs> Leave your shoes on. <laughs> but good storage. It is. Not that, I mean, if you're a full-timer in a coach like this, you can, but either way, you still have a lot of storage. Did you remember to show off the emergency escape door behind the toilet? No, though? would you do that? No, oh, because this one, this one should have a ladder. I remember we had a comment about that. There you go. We'll move these up. And then that pulls apart. There's that little ladder in there. Yeah. This piece here, I believe. I think I'm just jumping out because I don't know if you yeah, got time. Yeah, I'm not huh? going to be trying to figure that out. <laughs> yeah. But um, there it is. There's the ladder. Get the owner's manual out real quick. Read it. and then Oh, yeah. yeah. By then it's over. So... Behind the toilet, you can see all the wiring for it. And I learned this trick from a customer, Maui Mike. If the black tank has a piece of debris on the sensor and it's reading full, the toilet won't work. And he said there's a yellow wire back here you can disconnect. Hmm. So if you know the tank's empty and, and you've got room, you can. it doesn't screw up your camping trip. I thought Maui Mike was going to say, you know, when things, you know, a little Mexican food and he just opens up that door Open right there. And sits a little further back. <laughs> Maybe that's that what he sits back, but just get the airflow in here. Oh, okay. All right. Well, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, it's a good little tip though. There's a yellow and I can see it back here. You can unplug it and, and then use your toilet so you can get your uh, tanks rinsed and <laughs> fix that sensor. Yeah. Enough just, room to put a bidet? Oh. You could do it a bidet. Yeah. High pressure turbo model. All right, so we got through that. Anything else you want to add to this, Damon? I think we covered it, Lou. That's all LED lights. I tell you, why buy new? That's the the game plan on this one. When yeah. you know this is like a brand new coach, and they've like you've said, debugged it and um, good price, two twenty nine. 13,000 miles. So appreciate you watching the videos. Uh, we'll get another one maybe today. What do you Sounds think? Sounds good. All Let's right. do it. Thank, Thank you. you.